this video, Ryan explains why you should use offshore trusts instead of domestic trusts. My name's Ryan Fowler. A little bit about myself. I'm in asset protection, estate planning, and global investment consulting. I have a nationwide clientele. The net worth ranges from about $200,000 to over $100 million. I'm the author or co-author of two books on asset protection. The latest is Asset Protection and Financially Unsafe Times, co-authored with Dr. Arnold Goldstein. It's the best rated and one of the best selling books of its type on Amazon.com. Why use an offshore trust instead of just a trust in the United States? Well, most states in the, in the U.S. do not allow a self-settled tr trust to protect assets. A self-settled trust is a trust where the grantor puts assets in the trust and continues to benefit from those assets in some manner. So in most states you get no asset protection when you do that. Now a few states have what are called uh, domestic asset protection trust le uh, statutes, legislation. However, those statutes are they are not tested in court, they're not looked upon very favorably for a number of reasons. Number one, depending on what state you're in, um, and again only a few states allow these, um, but you're looking at two to four years of the asset being in the trust before it's even protected by law. And it, up until that point, it's vulnerable to creditors, for example. So most people, uh, when they use an asset protection trust, they go offshore. And when they go offshore, uh, they go to a jurisdiction that allows um, very complete and substantial protection um, for a self-settled asset protection trust. So if you've liked this video, I've got a copy of my book, Asset Protection in Financially Unsafe Times, as an ebook, a 20-minute no-cost consultation, and a series of asset protection secrets ready to be sent right to your email inbox. All this is free. Just visit www.assetprotectionoffer.com. Thanks.